Introducing Verbit's Caption Control feature. It offers an easy way for customers using Captivate to confirm audio, format captions, pass through upstream captions, and change session end times. To activate Caption Control, navigate to the Live Bookings tab. Find the active session. Select the button on the right titled Caption Control. When clicked, a new tab will open revealing the Caption Control console. Here you can see session details such as session name, start time, duration, encoder endpoint, and the current captioning position. By clicking on the large play button in the middle of the screen, you'll be able to confirm the Captivate captioning engine is receiving audio by seeing an animated audio waveform. To adjust the volume, hover over the speaker icon below and use the slider. This volume control is for confirming audio. It will not affect the audio received by Captivate. In the box below this, you'll see the caption text actively being generated from the audio source. Next, let's look at some of the specific live caption controls. Note the captions at the bottom middle of the screen, which are being sent by this session. By navigating to the bottom left of the audio playout box, you can select the active caption placement to reveal available placement options. When making a selection for caption placement, the selection will be pushed to the active session as demonstrated here. Next, we'll show blocking and passing upstream captions. In the top left of the audio playout box, below the session start time, you'll see a small pause button. When hovering over this button, it will indicate to the user that selecting this option will block the upstream captions from being sent to the encoder endpoint, as demonstrated here. Once captions are blocked, you'll be notified by text which will be displayed at the bottom left of the screen, as well as the box showing the Captivate captions in an orange hue. To resume the passing of Captivate captions, simply select the same button, which should now be shown as a play button and indicate the passing of upstream captions when hovered on. Finally, to the right of the Pass and Block Captions button is the Extend Session button. This Extend Session button will extend the active session by one hour each time it is selected, as demonstrated here. Above this option, you'll see the Session Duration Update with a new Session Duration Time. Be aware that this Extend Session Time option will only extend sessions to the beginning of the next scheduled session. Stay tuned for more Caption Control features to come. Verbit. Make words work.